Welcome back! This is Arcade Night! And the Emperor must first defend the towns and fortresses in his Black Sea territories. But also, guys, we're gonna try to catch the Dacian army on the field of battle for one crushing victory! So sit back on your comfy thrones, grab a golden chalice of your favorite tasty beverage, as we get ready to play Imperial Rome Season 2! The Emperor has some big plans today, uh, the biggest of them all being defending this town, and I believe there should be a pretty sizable Dacian army there, so this could be exactly what we want. Grab their big army on the battlefield in, in a huge pitch battle, wipe them out, and then we're going to sweep through their territories. And, and that's what also we're going to do, guys. We're going to try to take at least this fortress today. I think it is weak, and we could take it pretty quickly with minimal casualties but first uh, we're outside Olivia and I believe yes there are three lords that need our help we must protect them um, they are greatly outnumbered so let's see if we can get involved with this battle okay guys and yeah let's bring in all the onagers this is by far the most devastating weapon we have all right man all right Let's make sure we, we, we get properly set up. Oh, I see. They've got a good position over to the left. They can grab that hilltop. All right. That'll be fine. Make sure. Oh, yep. Roman engineers go down there. All right. We're all set up. Make sure my Praetorian guard and subscriber knights are following on the emperor. All right. Come on, man. Come on. Let's, let's go. Let's go. Let's set up. Let's set up. I want my cavalry over to this left flank. I don't believe any cataphracts came to the battle, because this is a, a, a lot of my, um... Oh, there's a few cataphracts. There's a few. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, engineers! Wonderful shot! All right, let's go ahead and bring the infantry over this way. We're just going to cut off any movement they, they can do. They, they will not flank us. They can come through the middle. But we're going to go ahead and send our cavalry in and our cataphracts in right now. There we go. There we go. Okay. I'm going to leave infantry. Come on, infantry. Oh, look at this bastard. Okay. Hold, hold steady, men. Hold steady. Forward facing, men. Forward facing. I'm going to go ahead and charge them in. Charge them in. Charge in infantry. Go, 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 go. Move forward. Move forward. Oh, Lord Karen is the same horse. All right, here we go, man. Here we go. Infantry. Hold here. Hold here. Hold here. Let's see if I can bring my cavalry back. Cataphracts, if I've got any of them. All right, we're just going to move the whole army forward. Bring the whole army forward. There we go. There we go. Oh, cavalry. Top of that hill. Infantry engage. Cavalry engage. Oh, good. Perfect. We're going to catch them in. Oh, yeah. Totally have them surrounded. All right. Let's take out these archers. There's so much damn activity. Can barely see half the time what's going on. There we go. All right, I, I think we've got them mostly taken care of. What, two enemies left? Glorious battle, man. Glorious indeed. I'm going to take a sip of my tasty beverage from my golden chalice. Mm hmm Oh, tasty indeed. <sighs> it feels good to be back. It feels good to be back. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Okay. Minimal casualties. I exactly what I would expect. Uh-huh. Ooh, I will definitely take you prisoner. And the other one, and the other one escaped. Let's see, anything? Fire archers. I love fire archers. There's no denying it. The Emperor sees great value in them. Uh, but you know what? I'm, I'm going to take the rest of these men because my army is not full. Wow, look at 185 slaves. That's incredible. Um, huh. I really don't want to clog up my army with the rest of this junk. Um, but, yep, I think we are in pretty good shape. 
Oh, it appears Januarius Justinus and Jeremiah Savius were both severely wounded in that battle. Both subscriber nice. I'm sure they'll be okay, though. Um, anything of value. I just I don't want to take up much room in my inventory. At this point, I don't think that's going to really change much. What I can get for these goods. I'm going to leave them be. Leave them be. Okay, so I think those lords are going to protect Olivia. On to the main mission. Defending this siege. Come here. All right. I'm hoping for more than one. Oh, that is what I want to see. That is what I have been looking for. Oh, my goodness. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. We, we, we want They're going to get scared. They're going to get scared. So we want to grab them. Because, you know, they can just hop out on the water because they've got instant ships. Hmm. Oh. See exactly. They're gonna escape, aren't they? Yep. Oh wait, wait. Where are they gonna go? Aha. Uh -huh. Looks like I'm gonna have to chase. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh, they scattered to the winds. That's exactly what I didn't want to have happen. Wow, that's, that's, that angers the Emperor so much, I swear. 142, I, I guess we need to protect this, this town a little bit better. Ah, look at that. Okay, so let's make sure we put someone um, that can protect this. Ah, Lord Cotton. You've been loyal. 100. I, I see that. I have a new task for you. I need you to go to... Ah, uh, there we go. Hmm. A and you, sir. You, sir, indeed. Um, I need you to... As well, yes. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Okay, so I... I, I feel pretty good about it. Now we're just... Their army's broken apart. We just don't have the speed, I believe, to take them all on. So, probably the best thing to do, while I still have a decent-sized army... Oh, I think... Okay, okay. It's, it's still well protected. This is... Let's see. Oh, yes. This is this is probably what we should do. I'm just going to go ahead and siege this fortress right now. Hmm. One fifty six, though, that's so insignificant. Let's try to take both, right? Let's take both. Hopefully, no siege towers. Okay, we're just gonna do it. We're gonna do it old school. Oh, come on, bring it on. You got two forty. Oh, I like it. Uh huh. Dacians are a bunch of cowards, I swear. Just a bunch of cowards. All right, I didn't even have the full force of my army. When I went to uh, defend that town on the Black Sea, but of course they ran away. I, I can't. I can't blame them though. Uh, how, how can you blame them? Ooh. Oh wow! Someone just head. Someone's head exploded right in front of the emperor. All right, make sure the engineers are doing their job. Get up there. All right, Praetorian Guard, make sure you're holding on the emperor. We're gonna need this. We need all the protection we can get. All right, let's see. Plenty of men. All right, go ahead and send the infantry in. First wave, go in, men. First wave, fire archers, let's go ahead and set up here. Give you the highest elevated position possible. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Fire archers right here. Thank you, sirs. All right, Praetorian Guard. Let's at least get close to the action, see if we can help out our men a little bit. Oh, look at that fireball go. I love the onagers and, and all the fire in this mod. That's one of the things that just, that I love the most. It makes the battle so much more chaotic. All right, all right. Let's see if we're doing, oh, we, we, we've killed quite a few. See if the Ipper could help out. Come here. Come here, sirs. 
Oh, these, these men up here. These men are dangerous. Get a hold of one of them. Lucky shot with one of my javelins. Oh, wait, no. Don't fire at me, sir. Oh, okay. One of my men got him. All right, let's get up, man. Let's go. Got a bunch of gladiator bodyguards behind me. Praetorian Guard. Yep, there they are. Praetorian Guard. Subscriber Knights. All right. Come on, man. Let's go, let's go, let's go. It's the last 50 of them. Ah, uh, we should bring the fire archers a little bit closer, shouldn't we? I'm sure I can see where I'm putting those men. Yes, right here. Very good. Very good. Come on, man. Come on, come on. We got a bunch of lords in front of me. Awesome. Uh, one last sip of my tasty beverage before we get on top of the walls. You can even leave anything for me. I, I, I fear. Yeah. Man. My legionnaires are doing such an amazing job. They're not even letting the emperor get up there. And I tell you what, the Dacians are one thing. Though, but once we start fighting the other Roman factions, it's going to be bloody. Ooh. Finally, something left for the emperor. A humble archer. A humble archer, indeed. What do we have left, guys? What are we looking at, gentlemen? What are we looking at here? Is, is there a man hiding out? Oh, I'm, I'm sure of it, right? There's definitely a man down there. What do we have? One enemy left. All right, guys. We're, we're going to try to find this last man. And when I do, we're going to cut back. We're going to move on to that next siege. See you in a second. So we've taken it, and we're going to grab as many men as we can to refill the garrison here. Um, but we're, of course, going to have to leave quite a few lords here to protect it. And, and as we go along, the army's going to get smaller and smaller. And that's really what I fear in these campaigns. You can only go so far. So I, I'm pretty sure that we're not going to conquer the entirety of the uh, Dacian Kingdom in one fell swoop. That would just be impractical. Um, hmm... I know, I know the morale, but uh, don't do it, don't do it, and I'm, I'm going to defer appointment for now. We'll do that later. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, so, let's see. Oh, there's, there's a few men there, fire archers. Ooh. I think we're good, though. We don't need any more fire archers, and uh, I'm surprised at how decent the garrison is they gave me, but uh, we're going to go ahead and drop off. Hmm... Some of these men. Some of the odds and ends. Yeah, you can take the javelineers. There we go. Bosran warriors will probably slit those men's throats in the middle of the night, though. That's what I fear. Roman veteran, yeah. Okay, very good. Um, we don't need any more Roman engineers. We're good to go, so we're going to call that a day. Um, wow. There's a marketplace here, but no, nope, he's got no money. Yep. Just like uh, most of the, uh, the fortresses, they do have a small marketplace where you can simply buy food, um, but you cannot sell anything there. So, let's see. You, sir, Bellocat, I command you to go ahead and uh, protect this fortress. Um, go to... Here we go. All right. Thank you, good sir, very much. All right. We're on a rampage today, guys. Next fortress, ooh, I hope you stick around for this. I I would love to take this army on. Where are they headed? You know, it's all about conquering territory. That is going to be a siege indeed. All right, guys. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. Let's see. Siege the castle. Um, Let's do it, guys. Oh. This is um, what I feared. Uh, they're far enough away from us, I, I believe. I, you know, the, I think they're one of those parties that, that's pretty close, that has actually, um, that has the, the town of Nose. All right, we're going to have to finish this siege 
and um, take care of that. Uh, you know, maybe we can get a peace with the Dacian Kingdom so we can concentrate on the North Party. That's, that's probably the wisest course of action. But I, I've got something that I, I've got to tell all you guys, all you subscribers. And uh, it's how you're going to help decide exactly the course of action uh, of how we're going to go about these wars, these peace treaties, everything. We're, we're going to have a Senate. And so after this siege, I'm going to talk about all the details on how you could be elected to the Nova Roma Senate. Guys, it's going to be super exciting. The first ever elections um, on, on this channel. It's going to be glorious indeed. So all the details after we finish this siege. Because uh, the Emperor's got to concentrate. Uh, this is going to be bloody indeed. All right, let's see. Um, I just want to make sure my engineers are down there. Very good. Make sure I got my Praetorian Guard and Bodyguards close to the Emperor. Very good, very good. Um, what... What are you men in? Infantry? I think most of the cavalry charged up, unfortunately. Yep, I, I do believe so. Let's bring the infantry closer, though. Let's at least let them throw their uh, their javelins. Come on, men. Infantry, yep, yep, do that. I I'm, I'm going to join in, man. I'm going to join in. Let's throw some javelins. Of course, the emperor's got fire javelins, because he's cool like that. He doesn't have as good a aim. Oh, wait, wait, did I just get somebody? Oh, oh. Alright, infantry. I think that's enough. Let, let, let's head up. Oh, yeah. Plenty of men for the Emperor to fight. I got my legions at my back. Glorious. Let's go, men. Let's go. Oof. Oh no! Ah, oh. Emperor! Alright, let's see what we can do down here. Oh my goodness. Emperor is caught in a bad spot. Hmm. Ten men was one thing, but um, we got 30, 40 men here. Oof. Up and they are completely targeting me. Let's see. Ooh, I can't go this way. All right, all right. We're gonna fall gloriously in battle. That's okay. That's okay. Definitely kill this man. You bastard. I, I will kill you, sir, before I go down. I, I <laughs> Oh, I cannot believe this. Terrible. Terrible. 56 more men. Let's see if we can do this one more time. Um, yeah. Few men <laughs> were wounded. One of them being the Emperor himself. Oh, Emperor Rufus. I swear. Okay, guys. Let's do this one more time. Alright. Let's do this proper. We've got very little health. But, but we're going to make it work. Torian Guard. Hello on me. Let's bring those fire archers up real close this time. Roman Engineer is finally delivering. Very good. That's what I like to see. Oh my god. This, I think this is probably... Maybe the last 84 to 100 of them. Where are my fire archers? Where are my fire archers? You men should be much closer. I want to see you up right here on the edge of the walls. Let's go, let's go. Ooh. Come on, Rufus. Let's get a lucky shot somewhere in here before a stray arrow takes us out. Alright, fire archers. I I like it. You're finally getting up close. Finally getting in the action. Right here, man. Right here. Come on. Let, let the Emperor up. We're having some serious ladder problems here today. Come on. Come on. That's right. Alright. You're finally a gentleman. Letting the Emperor up, aren't you? Alright, here we go. 
Here we go. 50, 50 more men. The Emperor really wants to get involved. Come on, guys. All right, here we, here we go, here we go, here we go. Hold steady. Hold steady, Emperor. Wow. Wow. Well, I think we're going to take it. No, no thanks to the Emperor himself. But I think we just have this last 50 men. So we're going to go ahead and finish off this battle, guys. And then we've got the big news on the Senate elections. I'm going to see you in a second. Well, we finally took that fortress. So we put a pretty big dent in the Dacian Kingdom. Uh, they'll probably be pretty willing to accept a peace after this. But uh, for now, I'm going to take you prisoner, sir. For sure. Ooh. <laughs> I'll take you prisoner with your funny helmet as well. Wow, look at all these prisoners. Okay, we're going to need as many men as possible uh, to fill out this garrison. So I'm, I'm going to grab all these men. I'm going to get this garrison prepared. Ooh, engineer too. And then, like I promised, we're going to talk about the Senate elections. It's election time on Imperial Rome. And this season, what we're going to do is we're going to have senators that represent each region of the great Emperor Rufus's empire. And these senators will have special access to akram.engine.com where they're going to be able to direct the course of this season as well as the wars to come. And now, you viewers, you subscribers will actually elect which senator will represent each region. And I'm going to explain all of that. But first of all, let's just make sure we're all aware that we're going to have a senator that represents the Black Sea uh, territories. Also, we're going to have another senator representing the Armenian territory. So from Ardashat uh, down to Odessa Fortress, this area here in the steppes. Uh, then we're going to have another senator representing Judea. So right above this fortress probably is their territory down through the deserts, cutting off here about where Gaza is. And then the final senator, the one we're going to elect very soon, and the first senator we're going to have, is a senator representing Africa. So uh, pretty much here from the Nile all the way on, and, and perhaps uh, maybe the senator can uh, convince us to extend our territories out into this area. So you see there's opportunities for senators to perhaps increase their power by convincing the emperor to move here. Other senators may have a harder time if they're stuck in Judea. Uh, who knows all the interesting things that could happen. But we're going to have our first election soon, so let's talk about all those details. The election for the senator from Africa will take place very soon, but first we need nominees. If you want to be nominated, then simply place a one-paragraph speech in the comments section of this episode detailing to the subscribers why they should vote for you. I will select two nominees and we'll have a, their campaign speech read in a future episode and you viewers will get to vote for your choice to represent the African territories. Plus this elected official, this senator, will join the Senate Chambers on akrealm.engine.com where you will also join my Praetorian Guard subscriber knights and the other future senators helping direct the course of this season and the wars to come. Guys, I am so excited about this. I left my golden chalice to all the future senators and nominees. We are certainly at war with the North Party. And, and of course, they want to curb the power of Nova Roma. I don't blame them. I don't blame them at all. So we're going to have to end this war against the Dacians fairly soon. And uh, this is perfect, though. I, I would rather take this town anyway and uh, try to go against another Roman power early this season rather than having to wait. But uh, I want all these territories. Indeed, I want all of them. Um, and we may open up another Senate position uh, once we grab the rest of this. Maybe a, a senator from, from Greece, perhaps? I, I, I don't know. We're going to have to decide, but that's going to be pretty interesting. Uh, but yes, uh, maybe in the next episode, we can head back to Antioa, try to get a peace agreement with the Dacians so we can concentrate 
on the uh, the North Party. But you see, this is why I need some senators to help me make these decisions. So we need to get these elections done soon. So guys, don't forget to leave your campaign speech in the comment section of this episode and I will pick the top two nominees and you'll have your speech read uh, very soon, perhaps in the next episode. And uh, you subscribers are going to get to vote on that. It's going to be the first ever elections on this channel. It's going to be awesome. But guys, I want to thank you for joining me. I had an amazing time in this episode. I I've been waiting to play uh, Season 2 of Imperial Rome for so long. I've been waiting to do these elections for so long. I'm just so excited. We're finally getting to do it. Finally back in action. Guys, it's glorious. You guys are awesome. Thank you for joining me so much. If you enjoyed this episode, make sure you hit that like button. It's one of the best ways to help this channel grow. Also, if you ever want to become a subscriber tonight, Praetorian Guard member, which we will have more this season, I promise you. You need to hit that like button often. Also, guys, if you're not a subscriber yet, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button. Again, I want to thank you for joining me, and I'll see you next time on Imperial Rome Season 2.